Good Thursday evening, everyone. How's your week been so far? Here in Ontario, it has been gorgeous, sunny, and warm, and I have been enjoying it as much as I can, because before you know it, it'll be gone. Um, so we are on, in Canada, we're on stage, well, in Ontario, we are in stage two, so certain things are open, so thank God my hairdresser is open. I have an appointment next Thursday, uh, because to be honest with you, I got to, I've been getting to watch my grandbabies, um, because now you can be around small groups of your family and stuff. So my youngest daughter has been, she uh, worked for a dentist, and then she had um, Finn, and then she went back to work for the dentist, and then she had Macklin, um, who turns one this month, and Finn turns three next month. Um, so she's decided she's going to stay home and work for her husband, but she's going to have to do some stuff. So I get to twice a week uh, spend the day with my grandbabies and have fun with them while she is working and I've seen uh, my other four grandbabies and spent some time with them but I was looking in the mirror the other day and I know we're all feeling this but I thought oh my god like okay no I don't have a lot of gray thank god at 58 that's not bad but you know it's not so I'm going to do my hair. I'm going to get it colored. I'm going to start wearing a little bit of makeup. I'm not a big makeup person to begin with. I don't wear foundation and stuff, but some mascara, a little bit of color. I want to start feeling back to being yippee like I always was. And this lockdown has put us all in a bunch of crap. So um, that's what I'm going to start doing, changing this week. Plus, I want to show you the reason I haven't been really working much on video this week. Now, the bandage is smaller now, thank goodness, because it was huge before. This is a live and learn experience. No, it's not. This is a freaking wake-up call experience. Like, smart up. The other day, I was changing the... Um, sand belt on my belt sander belt sander sand, whatever i was changing the belt and i put it down and i turned it on to see if i had tightened it on enough it wasn't tight enough so i turned it off and when i turned it off not even thinking i put my hand down on the sander to slow down the belt and luckily it could have been a hell of a lot worse it, my baby finger hit first and I grabbed my hand like this and went running upstairs and I, Gavin was on a freaking business call and he says to the gentleman he was talking to, he says, I'm really sorry, I gotta go. My wife just cut her finger really badly with a knife. Really? Because that wasn't this one. But anyway, so he did it all for me because you know what as a mom I could take care of any boob in my girl's head anything but when it's myself I can't handle it man I just cannot handle it so he took care of it for me and luckily the skin was still a little bit so he put it back on to keep it from hurting so much and um it looks like it's getting better slowly but surely it hurts like hell to touch but but um, it looks like I'm not going to have any fingerprints. So I could rob a bank with my baby finger and never get caught. All with my baby finger. Okay, so tonight, this is what I'm doing tonight. I am going to try alcohol, art, and dripping. I watched a video of Phil Danner doing this. And by the way... This, if you remember, is my sun and moon that Phil Danner made for me. Phil Danner is an amazing, if you don't know who he is, he's in our art group. 
uh, Resin Artist Without Borders on Facebook. He makes amazing molds. These molds are interchangeable. These ones right here. Um, you can take these tops off and I've got coasters and I've got a tray topping and he has recently made some amazing um, silicone molds as well that I would love to get. But you know what? Amer for, for Americans to buy Canadian, you guys have it made because our dollar is only worth 73 cents to yours. So it's a bonus. Uh, for us to buy American, it is hell because there is that difference. So we pay more, you pay less. Okay, so I watched what he did and I'm gonna see if I can give it a try. And the colors I am using, I ordered this uh, alcohol ink from the States. Um, this is Bray Reese alcohol inks and the colors are amazing just amazing and they are they were on sale when i bought them they are not that expensive at all hence the fact that i bought american plus canada doesn't have the greatest of alcohol inks here so we are going to give these a try and the colors i'm using tonight are lavender we are going to use medium magenta we are going to use turquoise and we are going to use Sky. And I'm using uh, the white and the rich gold. Okay, so I'm going to start, I'm gonna start with the magenta. And I'm just gonna go in with drips. And then I noticed that he put the white on top of his colors. And I think, I think that is to drop the colors down so that the colors will sink in and not just float on the top. So I hope I am doing this right. If not, I'm living and learning. So there's my white. Let's try the sky blue sky blue and then go in with some more white on the blue Okay, and now I'm going to try some gold for my son. I love gold. I love gold. This is fun. I'm just dripping it in where I want it. on top with the white. What else I love about ink is if you can see, it's like the ink keeps moving, mostly gold. When you dip it into the resin, it's like it's alive. It just keeps moving, breathing. It is so cool to see. Okay, I think for now, I'm gonna leave the sun like that. And I think the moon, I'm going to do the lavender and the turquoise. Drop some light. Bring 
in some turquoise. Such a beautiful color. I'm filling in. Bring in the white. Lavender, a little bit more white, and I'm going to add some gold so it pulls them all together. And then put some white on the gold and see if that'll bring it down. And we don't have anything going on here, so. Bring a little more gold over here. Yeah, some gold up here. Gold, white. There we go. That I am leaving just like that. And hopefully this will set overnight. It may not with ink. It may take a little longer for it to cure than just using resin colors. But that's okay. We will wait and see how it goes. So what else I have done, I will take you over and show you because I have to do a clear coat of resin over it tonight. I'm just doing up my colors so they don't evaporate. Alcohol likes to evaporate. Oh, I hope this turns out. That was fun to do. It's, it's funny when you can't really control something. That, for me, is very hard to deal with. Okay, come on over here. Guess what I did? Yes, guys, I attempted another geode on my own. And we know how myself and geodes don't get along. But so far, so good with this one. So... I'm just going to clear coat this because it's where I want it to be now. I don't want to add any more stone, any more glitter. I'm not going to push it. I'm just going to clear coat this and hopefully this will be my first, not, not a great, trust me, compared to a million of you who do the most amazing geodes, like my friend Darshana. This is nothing compared to yours, guys, but, but it didn't hate me completely. I still have... A lot to learn, but I have no patience, and that's why geodes get the best of me, because you definitely need patience with geodes, right? And my hat's off to all of you who can do beautiful, beautiful geodes, because I definitely can't. But this one was fun. Like I said, it didn't get the best of me. I didn't swear at it. It didn't swear at me. At least not that I know of. may have done it behind my back when I left the room. But it's in my colors. My beautiful blue. My favorite rose gold.
The Rose Gold Glitter is by Just For You Online UK. They have a beautiful rose gold glitter. Those gals have it all together there in the UK, those sisters. If you have no idea who they are, go check out their webpage. Like I said, it's just for you. The four is the number four. Just for you, online UK. Okay, so there we go, guys. This is where I am leaving it. I am not going to touch it anymore. I did do a few little molds here for another piece I want to do down the road. I did an octopus and a koi fish and two other little fish. Here is our alcohol ink and we will see how it all goes. So guys, yes, I'm gonna get back into doing more videos. If there's anything you would like to learn, just shoot me a line, put it in the message down below, uh, private message me, blah, blah, blah and I will try some stuff out. I'm working on, I'll show you right now, I'm working on these two pieces. I dry glittered them first. This is the fairy on the moon, and this is my angel. I have a few new boards coming in hopefully this weekend. I also have a secret project that hopefully will be ready for me to pick up and work on um, early next week because if I can do what I want to do to it, this is going to be amazing and I'm going to love it. So I'll fill you in on that, that's a secret when it comes about. So you guys have a very wonderful, I know it's only Thursday, uh, but we have company coming tomorrow. Gavin's oldest daughter is coming um, for an early Father's Day and spending the day with him. So I will see you on the weekend, hopefully. And you guys have a great evening. Bye for now.